So Tara asked about the best practice for um, Instagram link tree. And for those who don't know, uh, let me show my screen. Instagram, uh, you know, people, uh, you, since you can't put links on your posts unless you run ads, people often use a service called Linktree. And so, which I do as well, and it's free. Uh, there's a paid service on Linktree, but I just use the free version. So if you click through, for example, on my Linktree, uh, it goes to my course, like authentic business planning course. That's really kind of like the first thing I want people to do if they're, they want to study with me, right? And so if they don't want that, then they can go to my Facebook page or my best videos or my best articles, mm. okay? Um, as I'm looking at this, I actually realized hmm, I don't even need them to go to my Facebook page because they're already on my Instagram and I'll, they'll probably see my ads here. So I think I'm going to remove this one and just have my best videos, my best articles. Um, and I might actually put a dollar sign how much this course costs. I think it's $75 uh, or 100 anyway. Um, and I might describe this as, uh, you know, recommended first course or something like that. Um, so as you can see, I don't have to update my link tree ever because this is always going to be the first course I recommend to everybody. So I don't have to like update it with my current newest. But if you want to have the current newest thing, you just have to add it to your own launch checklist whenever you launch a new course or launch a new service. Part of your checklist says update your link tree. And then that's way of doing it. Tara, can we look at yours or is that okay? Or no, should we look at someone um, else's? You're welcome to. Yeah, yeah. I have to jump right at one, but. <clears throat> okay. So, um, so link tree here. And what you have is you have five of them, which Some I think. Out of date. <laughs> what's that? Some out of date offerings. Some out of date offerings, which, which makes it more work, right? Um, and you have yeah. these links. Oh, these links go to your social media. Do you use the paid link tree or? I free? do. Yep. Okay, so this is the paid. That's why you have extra features that I, that I don't have. Yep. But I feel like um, it's probably too many because uh, I would say, I would say my four is even, but see, my descriptions are so, so simple. Mm -hmm. Whereas yours is kind of overwhelming. It is. Um, and the font's a little bit small for my taste anyway. Um, and there's a lot to read there. So yeah. I'm going to say the best thing I think podcasts make sense. People, you know, go a lot of people surf Instagram on their phone. So click through, they could go to a podcast thing. They can subscribe to the podcast pretty quickly. Book, maybe. Um, Instagram users, uh, yeah, you know, it gives you credibility. Yeah. Subscribe for weekly sure. insight. Yeah, maybe. Um, no more hiding. I would free webinar is, is, a, is a nice uh, kind of maybe inroad into, into your work. Um, or if you just want to give people like a one-to-one -one, book, a one-to-one -one coaching call, mm -hmm. if you, especially if you have a, if you're willing to do like free calls, one-to-one -one calls, exploratory, if you're open to like anybody booking it, then that could be a good button here. That's but a great otherwise, point. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Thank you. That's helpful. Yeah. I like that. 